Hello everyone and welcome to Symphony of Colors. Today again I am experimenting with these Fluid Acrylics uh, Demco and uh, I have uh, uh, six shades or uh, six colors over here with me and uh, uh, I'll be using these in all six colors in today's experiment. I'll um, use the um, these fluids um, acrylics and uh, coating medium on a one canvas and the on the other canvas I'll use this um, uh, 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 this brand with uh, the coating medium as well as the addition of uh, filtrol and I'll compare the results so I'm starting by adding uh, the colors in, in the cups this is around 10 ml of uh, uh, color over here I want to make a different shade of uh, bluish so I'm adding uh, half of sand in this cup, uh, this cup. I'll add more of uh, white in this experiment so I'll make a full cup of white Credon gold directly. I'll mix it with yellow and create a different shade for my pour. Over here in this blue, I'll add very uh, little amount of yellow to make give it a greenish tint. In this experiment, the amount of pouring medium is more than the fluid acrylics. Uh, the ratio is uh, almost 70-30 uh, um, or 60, around 60-40 or 70. So everything is in right holding consistency at this point. So uh, to be on safer side, let's add uh, some amount of uh, uh, silicone oil in each color. So I'll start with white, blue, cyan, this is my sea green and I'll break this with magenta. I have noticed a few uh, poor uh, yellow just after the uh, blue, uh, it makes lots of green. In the paint, so I'm trying to break it in between. So, this is a mixture of yellow and 
quite freeze so corn cold uh, hard to pronounce it So this I think so is enough amount uh, but we need to pour on the canvas number one and removing everything from here and keeping this canvas inside. What I want to do alongside and this experiment is to use the left drip over paint over this card stock which I bought from the uh, Walmart so that I can make a canvas with this, uh, a card with this. So this is really looking pretty. Uh, I hope you can see that. Uh, I can uh, right away see some mixing uh, of white and yellow in there and uh, I will give just a one uh, or two swirl in in this and then instead of doing a dirty pour I do a flip cup on the camera so I'm doing a flip cup change my mind I have covered the entire canvas and it's looking extremely pretty and it's uh, very very shiny I'll use whatever color is there on the uh, stick to cover the sides properly uh, sometimes I love these sides uh, more than what I like on the canvas and sometimes it happens so the canvas is covered properly now I'll wash my hands and then I'll bring the heat gun again Look at these wonderful cells. So I, so I got all my paints over here uh, in, in the front again and now we will start manipulating these with the uh, uh, float roll. We'll add some float roll. Uh, I've decided that I want one more uh, color over here and that's pink. 
what I have seen that all, uh, this plant is already uh, very in, uh, in in a right consistency and it moves uh, smoothly on canvas. Um, I'll check how it uh, reacts with uh, Flirtron and whether flirt addition to Flirtron uh, does something good or does something bad uh, to this specific paint. The paints are ready now. Again, something you know magical is happening on this canvas right now. Uh, very extremely pretty uh, cells are coming out. So this time I will tilt it first and then uh, use the heat gun. There is very good cell activity happening on, on this specific side. Now I am using heat gun on high setting for uh, bringing up cells. On not so much there's some areas which are devoid of paint so i'll just use a stick to pick some paint from the cardstock and add over here lots of paint still dripping from it and now this was with, uh, better without uh, floor troll in my opinion So these are the dry paintings from this experiment. Uh, this one is with uh, 70 to 60 percent modern medium and uh, uh, 40 or 30 percent of uh, fluid acrylics. It's very shiny and uh, I hope you can see that in the cells are uh, I would say very defined cells nice in shape uh these are uh, these results are uh, uh, in agreement with the last uh, coding that i did uh, in which the uh, fluid acrylics and the pouring medium were in 50 50 percent quantity but in this the i have increased the amount of pouring medium reduced the amount of uh, uh, fluid acrylics this is where i have added uh, fluid roll so the uh, uh, consistency of uh, uh, fluid acrylic uh, fluotrol and coating medium is like this fluotrol is 50 percent coating medium is 30 percent and uh, uh, the fluid acrylic is uh, tw uh, around 20 percent this is also a unique kind of uh, um, result uh, and uh, it was really looking uh, pretty when it was wet but it has dried uh, I, I would say there is not much shine on this on certain part you can see some shining I hope you can see that but overall it's a it's a matte kind of fresh type uh, um, or matte matte look so to so this the, this is the result I would say 
you know i'm i like this one better and uh, for for unique uh, different kind of experiment uh, we can use this as well uh, in this colors are brighter maybe because colors are uh, almost 30 to 40 percent in a cup in this experiment and color has come down to almost uh, 20 or less percent in in this specific experiment so this is the result and you can decide what you like the best and then choose uh, coating medium uh, fluid troll and fluid acrylics accordingly uh, thank you for watching and uh, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also hit the bell, bell button so so that you can also uh, get notification for uh, my next experiments thank you very much